is up guys, it is Joe here from Joe Talks Wrestling and today I am bringing you my WWE Survivor Series 2020 predictions video. I am indeed registering for the Thunderdome so fingers crossed guys, I will be in the Thunderdome for Survivor Series but if you've seen my Drew McIntyre wins the WWE Championship reaction, you guys will know that I have now figured out an efficient way to film my personal reaction live in the Thunderdome for you guys to see. So just because I'm in the Thunderdome doesn't mean we're not getting any reaction videos this time round. For Survivor Series, you will be seeing reaction videos. But that's me done rambling. Let's get right into the first match of Survivor Series. Okay, guys, so first up, this isn't actually a match. This is just my prediction of what Undertaker's farewell is going to be. Now, fingers crossed, it is a farewell. Taker's done it all. He's the person I respect the most in the wrestling industry. However, I think he should be done. And I think this is literally just going to be a nice little, like, homage. He's going to come out, stand in the ring, maybe talk. Uh, well, no, definitely talk. And just say goodbye to the wrestling ring. He doesn't need to compete anymore. Uh, I don't want to see Taker compete anymore. That's not going to stop me making a fantasy booking video, though. But I honestly think it's just going to be Undertaker retiring. And, uh, yeah, that's it's just going to be just that. Undertaker retiring. A nice, like, heartfelt little segment of the show. I don't think anyone's going to interrupt, or I hope they don't. But, yeah, Undertaker's farewell. I'm very much looking forward to it. Okay, so technically the first match on the Survivor Series card, we have the Intercontinental Champion representing SmackDown, Sami Zayn, taking on the United States Champion representing the Hurt Business and Raw, Bobby Lashley. Lashley is beating Zayn. I do not see Sami Zayn going over here. I see Bobby Lashley picking up the victory for Team Raw. Next up, we have one of the matches I am looking forward to more than anything. It's literally, well, no, it is my second most looking forward to match on the card. The New Day representing Raw, the Raw Tag Team Champions, taking on the SmackDown Tag Team Champions, the Street Profits. New Day wants the smoke. Uh, who is going to win? I honestly can't predict this one. It's really difficult. Uh, but SmackDown versus Raw, Street Profits versus New Day. I am going with the Street Profits to beat the New Day, making it 1-1, one, one, a tie, Raw and SmackDown. Let's get into the next match. Okay, everyone. Next up, we have the Battle of the Women's Champions. We have... Asuka representing Raw as the Raw Women's Champion, taking on Sasha Banks representing SmackDown as the SmackDown Women's Champion. And Sasha has been on a roll recently. And despite losing to Asuka already a few times this year, I am going with Sasha Banks to beat Asuka, making it 2-1 to Team Blue. Okay, guys, next up we have the women's five on five traditional Survivor Series tag team matchup. And this has been changed recently. It was meant to be uh, Dana Brooke and Mandy Rose in there representing Raw, but now it is Nia Jax, Shayna Baszler, them two, the women's tag team champions, Lana, Lacey Evans, and Peyton Royce taking on Bianca Belair, Ruby Riot, Liv Morgan, and two to be determined contestants. Now, we don't know who these are. I honestly don't see them being uh, too big. However, if you want me to give an out there prediction, I am going with the Bella Twins to return and fight its Survivor Series. Uh, there's been rumours of them coming back. I don't know how good them rumours are, but I honestly, there's there's no one really on SmackDown of too much importance to uh, go in. So if, if they want to give us a big shock surprise, then uh, Bella Twins to return. I don't think it's actually going to happen, but it would be cool. But anyways, I am going with Team Raw to win, making it even once again. Two to Raw, two to SmackDown. Let's move on to the next match. And next up, ladies and gentlemen, we have the men's five on five traditional Survivor Series tag team matchup representing Team Raw, Keith Lee, Riddle, AJ Styles, Braun Strowman and Fireface, aka Sheamus. Then they are taking on Team Smackdown, the Monday Night Messiah that I can't call him that anymore because he's on Smackdown. Uh-oh, Seth Rollins, Kevin Owens, King Corbin, Jay Uso, and then there is one space left to be determined. I don't know who that's going to be, but I don't see it being a big surprise. 
And uh, because of that, I just think, you know, someone random. However, I am going with Team Smackdown. Now, Team Raw has been falling to absolute pieces every single week since the uh, the matchup started to begin for them to actually qualify for the Survivor Series team. I think it's going to be the same. Team Raw is going to fall apart on Sunday and uh, Team Smackdown is going to pick up the one, making them 3-2, putting them in the lead. And that brings us to the main event of the evening, the brand new WWE Champion, Drew McIntyre, taking on the Tribal Chief, Roman Reigns, the Blue Universal Champion versus the WWE Champion. It is going to be a clash of the Titans, a WrestleMania 35 rematch. And do I think anything's going to happen? Now, I did initially think The Miz was going to uh, cash in his Money in the Bank at Survivor Series, only because it would have been 10 years since he cashed in the Money in the Bank briefcase for the WWE Championship on Randy Orton, and uh, he would have been doing that exact same thing 10 years later. But Randy's no longer champ. Do I think he might cash in? <sighs> Potentially. It's still 10 years to the day, so he might, he might, I don't know. It's, it's a really confusing one, but I think Roman Reigns is going to beat Drew McIntyre. Uh, I don't know if he's going to beat him clean. The thing is, these two are both booked so strongly that um, I honestly don't know. But I'm going to go with Roman Reigns to pick up the victory, meaning SmackDown win at Survivor Series. Then maybe Miz will come out and cash in or try and cash in or something. But at the end of the day, I've got Roman Reigns winning, Team SmackDown winning. I am on Team Blue this year for Survivor Series. Let me know what your guys' predictions are in the comments section down below. Are you excited for Survivor Series? I sure am. But I've been Joe from Joe Talks Wrestling. You guys have been awesome. Please be sure to give this video a like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye. Ah!